On the left hand side, in this first of our semi-finals, Team Fluffy Pink Rainbow Unicorn Warriors. We have Tylan on the Tyrande and Grimmy on, on the Cassia. On the right side, we have Team Rocket with Burley on the Ragnaros and Kyra on the Alarak. Uh, <laughs> and they're, they're starting doing again. They're doing it again. They're, they're starting off the game with a slogan. I expect them, if they win this tournament, to come in wordlessly into the winner interview and just start doing their thing. Absolutely. Absolutely. And I, 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 yeah, I really hope they're doing it. If they're not doing that, they're getting disqualified. So it's so easy. Yeah, right. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, right. got this painting power on Alra, Cubil on Cassia, and the Moonlight Arrows on Durand again. Nothing new. All right, they're, they're just st starting to play and finishing their slogan. Oh boy. I'm not finished yet. Oh no, that... maybe we should finish it. I don't know it. <laughs> but... uh, all right, okay, so we've seen a little bit of brawling. <laughs> Alarak uh, yeah. got in a little bit of trouble, but he's fine now. <laughs> there they go! Now their slogan <laughs> is finished. The and they're about to. <laughs> yeah. And they're about to continue brawling. <laughs> Getting I love this guy. Stealing away the enemy's globe. That's actually pretty good. And just waiting for the right opportunity to stream. I mean, the the Ragnaros can just poke away with his uh, with his uh, meteor, but the Alarak has to set up a ri the, the right activated. moment. Control right. Well done. This work. It might have been there. They might have gone for it. Sadly, They're missing the telekinesis. There. Oh. Oh, oh, there, there comes the stun, time. and there he is dead. First point for the fluffy pink, fluffy ra pink rainbow unicorn warriors. Right. Uh, it's so exhausting. <laughs> 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 All right, but that's not the end of the world. I mean, it's just the start. Team Rocket can just come back, like that, for example. Just a quick blasting silence. the Tyrande off, and then it's yeah. good again. Right, but the Tyranna has a lot of heals. Ragnaros right now coming in from the top. Claiming... No, not claiming the... Not claiming the beacon. We really need to do that a rule, it would be so much fun. They're just starting to engage onto the Tyranna, but they're being counter-engaged ah, by the Cassia, and that's a dead Alarak. There. There's the second end. Uh, the... I'm okay. Yeah, third he's... Point? He's just taunting. Second That's the and third, third point, point for the... Fluffy Pink Rainbow Unicorn Varus. Uh, I love it when... Ah. You, I, I love it when you say the name. Um, I should just record it with my phone and play it into the microphone every time I want to say it. That could be a... Uh, yeah. That could work. Alarak now coming in again. And dropping... Damage onto the Cassia. Meanwhile, one more point for the blue team. Yeah. Four points against zero. Alarak pretty... Uh, almost half-life. But the silence onto the Cassia. Maybe they can... No, they can't. The blind is just too bad for them. Yeah, the, the, the blind is just there really, goes. really hard. And they, I mean, closely there. I mean, the heals from the Tyrande aren't too bad either. Yeah, with that Quill and Reduct, it's pretty. Yeah, that's pretty oh. hard. It's pretty, pretty hard to counter. Yeah, that's right. All right, level four now for both teams. We have almost, uh, we have already a level lead on the side of the fluffy pink rainbow unicorn warriors. <laughs> and an engaged onto the Tyrande, but there's the blighter to the Alarak. Damage. <laughs> Dropped, stun dropped, and that's almost a dead, uh, a dead Ragnaros. But Ra Ragnaros going into the fort now, dropping damage, not doing 
too much there. Yeah. It seems the ra that Ragnaros isn't that great. Oh, dropping the quick stun out of the uh, onto the exit point of the fort. That's great. More damage onto the Ragnaros. Ragnaros died once more. That's four points in kills, three points in structures. Coming up to seven points against zero. Yep, that's pretty hard to push already. Yeah, that's almost impossible to come back from that. Uh, yeah, but who knows? Maybe they they're able to do it. That's a dead Alarak. A quickly placed stun from the Turanda. Actually, pretty well aimed. The stun. <laughs> There is and the taunting again. Yeah. They're pretty much. They're they know. Accepting they lose in this round, bad draft. Yeah, I think they, they know. know that. They know that the game is basically over. They got a drafted. Two minutes. But I still have a chance to come back. It's not like it's lost already. Ah, uh, yeah, that's right. But how? No, no, I not mean in this game. I. To oh, be honest, all right, okay, this game okay. Basically yeah. set. This this game is basically lost. Like five, six, seven, eight, nine points to O. Oh. Yeah, nine points to zero. That's I don't think you managed to do nine points in one and a half this minutes. Time. No, not going to happen. That would seriously impress me. Yeah, they would have to stand a double kill and just rip through the fort, which they can't this. really do. Right. So basically, this game is over. So, but there's another side, and a blind, and the damage onto the Alarak. The last cube? They won yep. that kill. It's an auto attack, it hits. The Alarak is dead. And now, the Ragnaros gets stunned, gets blinded, gets yeah. ended, and is dead too. This is, yeah. Yeah, this is it. Pretty one sided, I'd say. Yeah, this game was really, really uh, one sided. Yeah, I think Team Rocket just got plain simple outdrafted there. Yeah, absolutely. Against this range, you just absolutely. can't disengage. You just get poked down so fast. Definitely. Definitely. Yeah, All GG's. Right. That's GG. We have the second game of the first semi-final on the left-hand side. Team Rocket with Cairo42 on Garrosh and Barely on Zagara. And on the right side we have the team Fluffy, Pink, Rainbow, Unicorn, Rarius. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> with Grimmy on the Lily and Thailand on the Zaya. Alright. The Fluffy, Pink, Rainbow, Unicorn Warriors are currently up 1-0 in the series. And... Yes. Let's see if they can close out the series 2-0, or if we have I'll to go to I'll tell you next this. season I'm just gonna demand name changes for such names. <laughs> nah, they don't violate the terms of uh, the, the rules. I'm so the team manager, I can change that. Yeah, I'm the organizer, I can change the rules. That's okay. <laughs> Alright, but so far we saw a small engage onto the garage, but nothing too much. Let's talk about talents. Unrivaled um, talents are things you can pick actually. Unrivaled strength on the garage. He can throw enemies further now. That's nice. Volatile asset again. And nothing surprising on the other ones. Feel the heat basically mimicking the draft out of the second season. And. Yeah. Then we do have some. Oh! Lily gets, Lily gets thrown there. Yes, in fact, they did spot. With the old garage, they had a problem now. Huh? <laughs> With the old garage, they had a problem now. Yeah, they of would course, have of course. Problem. Of course. <laughs> Not a buddy just brought me. We are, we are fucking retarded for keeping the stream up this long. Yeah, abs absolutely. Without we are. going mental. <laughs> Absolutely, we are. I mean, my I mean, my stream is just trying to reconnect, but the uh, the recording goes on. At least that. I mean, I'm already completely ham for keeping up with this, but you're even even insaner. You got like two concerts the last two days and the one tomorrow, I think. Yeah, absolutely, and a stream today. Sounds great. Basically, your voice is like I I don't want to work anymore. Yeah, that's okay, but I. Th I feel my voice is pretty fine for that. 
All right, yeah. but let's keep it on the game. Um, My voice is now already more fucked up than yours. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's keep it on the game. Yarosh tries to invade the enemy team. The stream is back up. Nice. Uh, yeah, tries to invade the stream, and Dados then we do it. The smashing with the chair. Right. And the Zaya ring. Oh, the how you Zaya ring. What? <laughs> Zaya ring. All right. But so far, nothing really surprising has happened. No deaths, no dead structures. But the Zarya gets thrown in. I mean, I, I think the Garrosh sh sh should save his... Oh, oh, oh! The Zagara got close to death th uh, there. Yeah, but back to the Garrosh. I think the Garrosh should uh, keep his Groundbreaker for after the throw. Yeah, probably to uh, way... get a full up stun there. Yeah, that... make more sense as well, I think. Right, that, that way he, w he would have way more tower damage onto the throne hero. Um, yeah, but other than that, he's doing a pretty good job. He himself was lacking a little bit in uh, in wave clear, but that's absolutely fine. He's garish after all. But that's where the Zagara comes in to clear the wave really quick. Oh, and the good thing is the Zaya just can eat them with their shields. That right. Just and takes that just away and that the main tower problem. And that just increases her damage as well. Yeah. If she tanks uh, uh, it with her shield. There comes the there throw. There comes the Gar. Oh, the Garrosh is actually pretty low, but, but now the Zarya gets well. low. Now shields up. Yeah, now the shield yeah, is coming. Everything's now. fine there. Stream has reconnected. But not as well. looking too bad for both teams right now. Right. They're pretty even out from the draft, I would say. Yeah. Absolutely. The only thing Zarya with level. Oh, okay. I'm the strongest. Okay. Interesting. Well, we have, yeah. the, we have the Envenom Spines on the Zagara, that's totally fine. There is nearly dead... In front oh. Of the oh, that's a nearly dead Zagara! Really close. Yeah, more shield on the... Uh, more shield on the... On the Zarya, if she, sh if she shields herself. That's absolutely perfect. And now the Garrosh is just... Healing himself up. Getting Sister's Tame back. With a with a flurry of uh, of his self healing, that's where his I talent comes in. If he ki if he kills an enemy with his uh, oh god, I don't know, I don't I don't know what it's called right now. Bloodthirst. If he kills an enemy with his blood yeah. his bloodthirst, his uh, uh, the the cooldown is instantly one. reset. Nah, that's not close. Zarya won't die due to due to attack. Yeah, not the Zarya, but the Zagara. Oh, you mean the Zagara? Yeah, that she that was, was really uh, low. that was calculated. All right, let's see. I mean, we are still up. There tight. is either the Lily just sustainably down poking the enemies with that slow. Yeah, that's right. But still, we are tied. Yeah, we are zero to points to zero points right now, and it's looking as if. Nothing's really going to happen soon. Yeah. Except if the Garrosh gets a real, a really, really great throw. Huh? The Lily just poking away with with her uh, with her winds. The Zarya poking away with her grenades. Uh, there comes the throw on a minion. The mi this minion must have done bad things. And actually, I want to notice um, the Zarya is ba is playing with Feel the Heat. So, if she would get close to Garrosh, she would deal insane amounts of damage. But that's the way where Garrosh ca uh, ca uh, comes in. You can't get close to Garrosh without dying. I think we can already prepare the sudden death message. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing's happening so far. Oh, oh well, there goes a little bit of damage onto the Zagara. Nothing much, but yeah, well, the Zagara has to be careful right now. Oh, oh, there goes there there's goes a dead the Zagara. Point. The first point for team? the. Do you want to say it? I think I have to say it, don't I? <laughs> the fluffy yeah. pink rainbow unicorn warriors. I just it's, wanted to start with Stitch. It's not that hard. 
It is. It's it's not that hard, but it's exhausting after you say it like the fourth, uh, the twentieth time today. Yeah, that's right. All right, but one against zero <laughs> with ten seconds to go. This looks like the game just concluded. There won't be a point. Yeah, that's pretty unlikely. Uh, the GG. 2-0 for the fluffy pink rainbow unicorn. Where is?